I'm here today to show you how to make a Hawaiian paper flower. And there's a couple different ways that I'll show you. This one is really, really nice, but it's also very delicate. So we'll see which way we want to go. So decide about the size, and that's what this would be. This is like a six by six by nine um, piece of paper, and you can do this all one color, or you could do multiple colors. You should have six to eight sheets. Don't go over eight because then it'll be too much to deal with. Line them up as best you can, and what you're going to do is do yourself about an inch fold back and forth, the old familiar fan fold. So we have this folded, and we need to know about where the middle is. It doesn't have to be a permanent crease, and I've taken the pipe cleaner, folded it in half, and just decide which one's going to be the top. You want purple in the center, or do you want yellow in the center? I think what I'd like is to have purple in the center. So what I'm going to do is bring that into the center, bring it in tight, and then twist it two, three times. Make sure it's in secure, like that. Now you could leave the paper just like this and pull your paper up, but I always like to do something um, a little bit fancier. And what I will do is this one but I will also tell you about this one that we had earlier. To do this one, you just simply would do your cuts in about two inches. Just do all about a quarter inch apart and two inches. Don't go in too far because you need some solid here. But for the other one, what I'm going to do is do little V cuts. And be careful when you're doing this because you want to not clip your fingers. Just a little ragged edge and you'll do both ends. Okay, what you need to do then is open your fan and taking one tissue paper at a time. So if you have, which I have two of one color, if you have every other color then you know exactly what you're grabbing, but I happen to have two of purple, two blue, and then you just pull up and down, and be careful because this is tissue paper, and if you pull too hard it will rip, but you just kind of bring it up to the center, and you will do this on both sides. And sometimes I leave a bit of a bottom one just to make the flower look a little bigger. See if we can get the opposite yellows here. There we go. And I might change my mind and bring them all forward, but sometimes if I leave one at the bottom, it makes it a little bit bigger. This I might bring up a little bit tighter to the center. Other side. So something like that. We can bring the other one in, and we can bring this other one in too. Hope you have a great day. Have fun.